it's in an incubator, they often lose weight, eh? which is a really bad thing because they're mm. supposed to be gaining weight. Mm. But if you massage them three times a day for 10 minutes, then they'll gain weight about as fast as they do in utero. And they leave the hospital on average five days earlier. And the beneficial cognitive and physiological effects are still detectable six months down the road. It's a walloping, it's a walloping effect. And so it turns out that one of the things Panksep sorted out was that human, the touch is a human need. It's not a secondary need, it's a mm-hmm. primary need like, like food and water. And, and childhood development. Yeah, yeah, well, and, and he, he was also a big proponent of rough and tumble play because yep. he found out that in rats that rough and tumble play, especially among juvenile males, catalyzes prefrontal development and that rat pups who are male that aren't allowed to engage in rough and tumble play show prefrontal hypodevelopment and you can then treat them with Ritalin which is the ADHD drug, just in case you're wondering. So that's a very dismal line of scientific research.